We are excited today to announce uh, a new discovery. It was an area we were actually first interested in back in, in 2011. Uh, it was one of the first areas we drilled ever on this property, this mix zone. And from what we learned uh, over the years here, we were eager to get back here from just things we've seen with some modeling um, Emily and our group's been doing and, and some work Peter's been doing. So it is a, a new discovery and it's the highest uh, grade intercept that we've had gold, silver off of this uh, zone one trend, as we're all quite familiar with, or those who aren't, that's what hosts our South Zone uh, PEA there. And we, of course, have our FMN hit big uh, 23 meters of 37 grams and our Franz outcrop. So this actually lies off of this and we're not quite sure at this point what's exciting about it is regardless if it's a splay or a whole new vein zone we're not entirely sure so we got uh, five more holes five out of the eight holes that intersected this vein are are in the lab uh, pending assays then of course these these three holes we just put out uh you know the the highlight of the 3.68 meters of 17 grams and a and a 27 gram hit over uh, almost two meters in there as well. So uh, nice, uh, hesitant to use the word mineable at this stage, but nice mineable wits, I will say that. So it's, uh, yeah, we're excited about it. And um, also on uh, not to take away that we did extend, um, um, kind of overshadowed a little bit now, but we did extend our hydrothermal breccia two target to the uh, north as well, which is about two kilometers parallel to the north of, Zane, of zone one trend where we, uh, did have some success in in ex extending that known mineralization as well. So uh, yeah, it's nothing. Uh, we're not quite there where we we seen the source of this this higher grade stuff, but we're we're finding more. And this is is really what uh, what we've you know our goal of this year was to find more gold off of the zone one trend and fill some of those gaps where we think there is going to be more um, you know mineralization. So we're we're excited that uh, we've sort of met that goal and we're going to continue to explore here. Uh, we got lots of room left for this year with the one rig going, uh, currently drilling at the uh, Franz to the Northwest there as well, but we'll be back at this MIC target uh, in, in due time as well. We're well financed here um, to, to continue on drilling right up until December. So we're uh, yeah excited about this new discovery. Then uh, obviously some other, uh, things pending in the lab as well. So, and uh, we're also finding that, as mentioned in this in this news release, we're also found an interesting uh, looking outcrop about three kilometers to the south of the south zone, uh, along trend along this zone one. So it appears that this quite long trend. This is this would be over seven kilometers of strike. We don't know if it's mineralized. There are assays in the lab for that as well. It looks like we could be in the upper parts of uh you know an epithermal system there. So assays pending there too. We do have boots on the ground uh, looking at that uh, and following that up along strike as well. So yeah, a lot of lot of good uh, boots on ground technical work done this year. And I think you're starting to see, um, you know, some of those exciting results here now. Before we've talked about the uh, the, the Hishigaki, Hishikari in Japan uh, analog there, obviously a, a, a great mine there by Sumo, Sumotomo's mine. And uh, that is starting to kind of come to fruition where you see these vein swarms. And that's, uh, like you said, it can be close to these these areas that we that looks like we've had a lot of uh, a focus on. But, um, you know, like I said, some of the work our technical team, Emily and Peter, have been doing, you can start to see these uh, these areas where you, you look like you're were close, but uh, whether it's drilled in the right azimuth, the right dip, you don't know. And sometimes it can be very... Uh, it's you're not far off, so it can be. Uh, but it's it's great to see. Like I said, these things are coming to fruition here, and uh, we hope for uh, more of these for uh, before the year end here as well.